everybody, welcome back. Andy Timmons here, Melodic Muse for Guitar World, and we're going to carry on with some C-sharp minor blues. Uh, for those of you curious, this track that I'm playing to is actually from my In the Jam course that I did for True Fire a while back. Uh, really great uh, sounding bunch of tracks that you can jam on with me on. If you're curious to check that out, please do. But let's dig back in. We're going to uh, turn on a bit more gain and play uh, some blues here. <laughs> up to the pentatonic but as soon as I choose a bend it's clear that I'm thinking of tension you know it's on a C sharp minor 9 but I decide to bend from from the uh, from the third to the fourth because that wants to go somewhere it needs to resolve been up to it maybe beyond it it's a major third so that might be a little difficult for some to, to get all the way up to that pitch but try there I'm just barely touching on it but I'm very accurate with the pitch I bend up through the scale like we worked on earlier. I made use of that uh, C sharp uh, minor Dorian. Just a nice way of kind of just building a little bit and getting playing some melodies. And then I switch to the B string, not only on the G string. At the end, I had to pull out one of my favorite uh, bin licks from uh, my buddy Steve Lugather, end of Rosanna, that really wide interval. But now, of course, that Rosanna's in, in G, this is C sharp. But I'm on the, on, the, on the B string, bending from the E to G sharp. You know, probably coming from uh, Albert King at some point, or Hendrix. But it's done in a trip D4. Then I do the same bend from the B to the, uh, yeah, what is it, B to D sharp. So on the, on the first on the B string, E to G sharp. And then. So as you can see, there's so much potential with bending to add to your melodies. You know, I'm, I've hopefully given you lots of ideas of how to kind of bend through the chord changes, how to, uh, you know, apply tension and release from bending to certain notes, releasing to certain notes. So please, uh, you know, hopefully you're, you're inspired by this. Keep playing, keep uh, working at this bending. And I'm going to do the same thing and we'll see you next time.